What's going on, money friends and the viewers of the tube? Today, we're gonna to be talking about Joystream and what is going on. A lot of you in the community have been asking what is going on with Joystream. Well, I'm here to let you guys know. Uh, if we go over to the, the community or actually the roadmap, let's go to the roadmap here. They have a lot going on and I'm very excited to, uh, to share with you guys because I think that, uh, and I think they're updating this, but they have some big things coming up like their Ethereum bridge, the new, and I did a video on the Ethereum bridge, the new exchange listing uh, comment recommendations, which is huge. Um, I don't know about you guys, but I, uh, when I go to Gleave, I get all sorts of videos on like Russian, I think that's Russian, uh, Spanish, uh, Spanish, so all sorts of different languages that I don't really know. And so that doesn't really help me. So I'm, I'm really excited to see what they do with the uh, machine learning bit. Um, as far as the progression of what they're doing here, I, you know, this seems pretty cool. I mean, uh, I think that they're trying to kind of just be a, another a, a YouTube that's decentralized. So I, I'm really excited to see what they, with the Snap development and how that goes. New wallets with uh, integration with both Ledger and Tangem which is pretty cool. And then obviously they are trying to get away from uh, API sync with uh, YouTube. So that's uh, pretty neat. They are gonna, it looks like they are possibly revamping the creator token, which I think they just did that. So they might be, uh, some of this might be already done and some of them might be, like I believe the ambassador program version 2.0 has already been released. New exchange listings, they're already on a lot of exchanges and playlists and so forth. What I'm really excited about are the staking nominal pools and the, where is it? The bounty modules. So that should be pretty interesting if they come up with this. Um, I'm really interested to see what they do with this. So I know that I put down a quite the proposal. I actually have two proposals, one uh, for pretty much applying it for the bounty program and running it with community building, influencer engagement, sponsorship acquisitions, uh, client str uh, content strategies, program management, feedback, podcasting, and building connections with other crypto projects. And uh, then I also pretty much said uh, of a whole uh, financial model change for joy we'll see what they do with it i'm very excited to see how this project goes lots of cool things on the horizon as far as why the price is dipping uh, your guess is as good as mine it could be um the cost of infrastructure i mean the cost of infrastructure is definitely expensive um you know it it doesn't take a lot of money to move uh the price down two percent i mean you know if they're spending a couple thousand dollars uh, a month on storage and fees, um, you know, that could as, you know, s essentially drop it, uh, you know, quite a bit. I, uh, you know, and if they add more creators and add more AI, uh, things that take, uh, that are expensive, then this price uh, can definitely drop more just depending on how much, uh, you know, this price movement drops. Right now, it's everything's sitting right around uh just under a penny and so if say ten thousand dollars uh drops it like what is that two percent ten thousand uh like i don't know twenty percent that's quite significant so um i'm really excited to see what happens i know that uh the creators are uh doing some great things with the creator tokens um let me pull up the creator token so if we go to the creator tokens you can see uh there's a market cap of uh 39,000. so that's pretty cool um some featured uh market cap of you know some some money here it looks like dip has some decent uh market cap going so that's pretty sweet um and then i'm number one for top channel earnings and then um Lee Joy, I think, is a um, a moderator of the group, and then Crypto Bullseye, a friend with Crypto Bullseye, 
so pretty good stuff here. I'm very excited to see what they do. Um, it seems like new creator tokens are being created every single uh, day. And so uh, let me know what you guys think. What do you think the price of Joy is going to do? Is it going to drop down um, you know, another, I think it just dropped down 2% just now, but is it gonna drop down uh, to what, a fifth of a penny? Or is it going to moon to over uh, 20x? If we just look at what has happened in the last um, hour or so, this is a kind of update before I launch the video, but uh, it dropped down uh, another five percent or so. So uh, definitely dropping. I I can see this going down a lot more to be honest. Um, I can definitely see it. Uh, dropping to say um, a fifth of a penny, like 0.5 here, um, in the la next maybe week or two. But I don't know. Maybe you know they come out with the roadmap and they have new money coming in and the base launches and they have all sorts of funds coming in and it could easily, easily, easily go up quite a bit. I mean, look at the spread here. I mean. Uh, it looks like the this uh, looks like uh, this just added a little bit, but um, you know the spread here is pretty. The depth is pretty good, so uh, I mean it wouldn't need a lot of money to push it up too much. Actually, it would probably need uh, a couple grand to push it up to uh, you know to back to a penny. But it would only need like 10 grand to drop it to uh, half of a penny. So, uh, yeah, I, I love that they are doing in advertising creators and showing what they're doing. And I think that's going to help them a lot. But um, I really want to see them turn around. So let me know what you guys think down below. Comment down below what you guys uh, want from Joy because I, I want it to succeed. But uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. Let me know in the comments below and I'll see you guys on the next one.